Perhaps it's inevitable in our oversharing culture that there are some couples willing to share every detail of their life and love with millions of viewers. And no, we're not talking about The Bachelor. Tonight, you're about to meet self-made YouTube reality stars who figured out the secret formula for turning their love stories into profit. Here's ABC's David Wright. The Bachelor is by no means the only one whose love life is on full display. I made a huge mistake. Now on YouTube, there are noteworthy examples of people who star in their own homemade reality shows. You wanted a story. We got a story for you. Case in point, Colleen Ballinger and Josh Evans. They're in Branson, Missouri. It's Josh's birthday. They've been dating for five years. <laughs> And you guessed it, Josh is about to pop the question. The proposal captured for posterity wife. on video. Will you marry me? <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> and posted oh to YouTube. 2,600,000 views and counting. And you guys make a living at this. Mm -hmm. We do. How it works is like, I have a tour, so there's some income from that. Um, we have merchandise, there's income from that, and then on YouTube, there's ad revenue. Stop! It's there so are some things you won't see on their YouTube channel. So weird. What about sex? What about sex? <laughs> Do we see it? No! Uh, absolutely. It's not that kind of a channel, oh my God! But their channels are hugely successful. Colleen and Josh have half a billion views between them. Sometimes I like to take slurpy baths. She has two YouTube personalities, appearing sometimes as her wacky alter ego, Miranda Sings, other times as herself. Look how wild she is. Miranda Sings was even recently featured on Comedians in Cars Getting Coffee, Jerry Seinfeld's online comedy show. So are we going to get the interview after the coffee? No, this is the interview. You haven't even asked me any questions. Josh is a rising star on YouTube. Singer and a personality. We're gonna vlogging, smack vlogging. someone in the back of the head just by vlogging. Known hey guys, as Joshua so, uh... Detail, with a huge following of his own. Is this a marriage or a merger? <laughs> this is a marriage. <laughs> it's a marriage. I mean, it's real. We just happen to be putting it all on the internet yeah. for everyone to watch. Much of their life vlogged, that's video blogged, right here from this room. Hey, where my baby's at? Questions. At the end of every single video that I do, I say, be nice to people. Be nice to people. Be nice to people. Be nice to people. And it's become this thing that's taken off, put it on shirts, and now all these kids are walking around town wearing a be nice to people shirt. So you keep saying kids. Mm -hmm. Who are these kids? The mass majority of, of our audience is 13 to 21. Those young viewers get a front row seat for the romance, the intimacy, and the occasional conflicts that come with any love story. Josh, stop. It's so disgusting. We are at the LA County Museum as they shoot their engagement photos, vlogging the whole time. And I gotta ask, we're in this very romantic setting. Yeah. But he stalks you on Facebook? Oh! Yes. He stalked me. He saw my videos on YouTube, and my Miranda videos. Really. And you fell in love with Miranda? And he fell in love with you Miranda. You fell in love with I think I, that should be a warning sign. I'm going to have to. Red flag right there. So now we're really true best friends. So he saw the Miranda videos, and he was like, there's got to be more to this. So he found the videos of me by myself with my sister just on my Facebook page. He stalked me on Facebook a little bit. Stalking is a harsh word, mm -hmm. I think. Mm -hmm. I looked into her. They actually vlogged their first date. Now, have you ever posted that anywhere? No. No, we were waiting until I think the this actual... is a nightline exclusive. <laughs> we will be getting married. I mean, once I, you know, get a ring and ask her, and she says, oh my God, yes. In an era when traditional soap operas like All My Children have bit the dust, this is where people are turning for serialized romance. And it's not a small audience. How many followers at this point? A lot. A lot. On my channels, on my two channels collectively, there's four million. There's Facebook, just a lot of eyes. YouTube. There's a lot of people who are interested in different parts of your life. Drive vlogging with them at an LA shopping so plaza, as we did. Right. Always look at the camera. And in 30 seconds, you'll see. Sure enough, some high school kids recognize them. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's hilarious. Josh and Colleen are in good company. The internet's biggest star, PewDiePie's other half, goes by Cutie Pie. They're out there vlogging too. 
Anthony Padilla from the hit channel Smosh just broke off his relationship with another popular YouTuber, Kalel Kitten. They explained their separation in this video. We are no longer together. Yeah. I know a lot of people are probably shocked, let's, obviously. Let's give them a moment to be heartbroken. <laughs> Some take it a step further, putting their whole family into the mix. We're here at the park. Audrey is apparently in charge. She told me I can't ride on that. How come you get to ride on that, but I can't ride on it? Can I ride now? No, no Dad, stop it, Dad. Brittany and Austin Null were inspired to start vlogging. They've been at it for nearly five years through the birth of their two children. I know a lot of people watch because of the kids, because they like to see them grow up. I've seen her come into the world. They've seen him come into the world. Like, they're part of the family, so cool and a little weird. <laughs> I love how you and your sister just like pop up right away. That white noise goes off, boom. Vlogging is a full-time job for them. Parents out there, take note, they both get to be with the kids full-time and make a pretty good living. I used to get super offended like when people would be like, you're not doing this right or you shouldn't do this. But now I realize people mean well most of the time. Hi, I'm David at the LA County Museum of Art with Colleen, Colleen Ballinger and Josh Evans. How you doing? Hey guys. And they're going to teach me how to vlog. I keep looking at myself. I right, know. Josh and Colleen showed me some of the do's and don'ts of vlogging. My arm is a little bit sore. Is that yeah. an occupational hazard? Yeah, it that is. is. Do you, what about those selfie poles? The, the I'm sticks? against selfie poles. Yeah. For richer, for poorer, for better or worse, happily ever after, or so they hope, if worse comes to worse, who gets the followers? <laughs> <laughs> I'll take them. I'll take on the responsibility. Is it. there a prenup? There, no, no. <laughs> prenup with followers? Uh, no, maybe. But let's I'm be honest, kidding. I'm taking them. One thing's for certain, they'll keep us posted. I'm David Wright for Nightline in Los Angeles.